Good Monday evening. I'm Thomas Fleming. Thank you for joining us tonight. The Cicero man accused of killing Utica teen Bianca Devins has requested to withdraw his guilty plea. His newly appointed attorney appeared in court this morning to file a motion to move forward with their request, but was unable to do so. Our reporter Jasmine Allen spoke with the Oneida County District Attorney's Office and tells us what caused a halt in filing the motion. 22-year-old Brandon Clark is accused of killing 17-year-old Bianca Devins on July 24th of 2019 on Post Street in East Utica. Devins was cut and stabbed with a knife, then images of her deceased body were shared across social media for several hours before being removed from public view. Back in February, Clark pleaded guilty to the second-degree murder charge but has since changed his decision. On July 28th of 2020, Clark requested to withdraw the guilty plea, insisting that he was coerced by his former defense attorney into accepting the charges. Clark's new attorney, Greg Starzewski, appeared in court this morning to file a motion to withdraw the guilty plea, but Oneida County District Attorney Scott McNamara says there was an issue with the paperwork. It's refusing to sign it, saying that that's not he, what's in it. He doesn't apparently he doesn't agree with or there's but there's some sort of issue between what the attorney was going to file and what the defendant wants filed. Judge Dwyer has granted more time for Clark and his attorney to come to an agreement and present the necessary signed paperwork. Clark is due back in court at 9.15 a.m. on September 22nd to answer arguments and decisions regarding the motion to withdraw his guilty plea. If convicted, Clark could face 25 years to life in prison. Reporting in Utica, Jasmine Allen, Eyewitness News.